here are solar and rocket heater powered food dehydrator. This is a beast. It's got this downstairs chamber and this upstairs chamber, kind of an attic. And both of them are solar powered and wood stove, rocket heater powered. So uh, this one up here, let's start in the back here. This is uh, a chamber with uh, a bunch of stone in it and a chimney and uh, a rocket heater bell. Uh, it's a, basically a drum full of hot gas that stores heat in that room. And when that room gets really hot up there from the sun and from the rocket heater, uh, it starts to pull air up through the slot at the top. There's a screen slot up the top and hot air comes out of there uh, with um, it's moist hot air because it's pulling all of the air out of the food dehydrator. So there's this chamber up here and there's a slot down the side of this wall. There's an insulated wall and a slot down the side of this wall that goes into the bottom of this chamber here. There's this like slot pulling air, pulling moist air out of the bottom of this chamber. It has to pull it through these screens. And there'll be like a dozen more screens that uh, is put a whole bunch of apricots or peaches or apples or something in there. And the warm air from this other chamber is pulled into here and pulled down through the screens and pulled through that slot down there. And look at how sooty my hands are from working today. And then pulled up and through that chamber and out. Well, the warm air is first made here in this chamber with a rocket heater in it and a, uh, in fact, it's still warm even though it hasn't been fired in hours because we've got these stones in here storing heat from the solar glass and storing heat from the rocket heater so that it can continue to gently circulate through the food dehydrator.